Take a moment, dear child, and listen carefully to the words I have for you. I know the world can be confusing and full of challenges, but there is something very important I need to warn you about. There is someone, whom you consider a friend, whom you have known since childhood, who knows everything about you, who is treacherously conspiring against you. Unfortunately, this person has been consumed by envy of your successes and now wants to see you fall. To avoid this path of pain, it is crucial that you steer clear of this dangerous trajectory. Do not allow the malice of others to influence your destiny. Stay alert and always choose the paths that lead to light and truth. As your loving father, I want you to know that dark forces are trying to destroy your life. Keep your eyes open, always be vigilant, and seek new paths so these forces do not corrupt your soul. This warning is not just for you but is especially urgent at this moment. If this message has reached you, it is a sign that I am offering you a chance to escape imminent death and suffering. Trust in the Lord. The angels are extremely concerned about you and the difficulties you may face. You could go through terrible times, and tears will be inevitable if you do not make the right decision. Your child is also in danger due to false friendships. You must protect him before something worse happens, it will be too painful to know that you could not prevent this tragedy. Do not follow the wrong path that is in your heart. If you feel the need to escape this circle of sin and vice, it is because the Holy Spirit is trying to guide you. If you do not listen to this voice attentively, you could face moments of great despair. Evil is approaching, and you will be responsible for the consequences if you do not act now. The enemy is trying to use hatred against you every day, looking for ways to destroy your life. No matter how smart you are, he will try to drag you into the abyss if you let him keep whispering in your ear, guiding your actions, and keeping you tied to sin. Things will not end well. Seek the true solution to all your problems. I trust in the Lord to find the true way out and prevent evil from stealing your happiness. God wants to open new doors for you where you will always be a just person. The angels warn you to listen to this message carefully. A family member may be dealing with a serious problem caused by an evil entity that needs to be eliminated before it proliferates and causes even more damage. Write 2020 to ask for your financial life to be illuminated. God will open new doors today instead of allowing the enemy to ruin your life. He is the first to help you find the true cause of your suffering. The enemy is trying to provoke you, but do not fall into the illusion he has prepared. The price will be too high. You need to escape from everything he is trying to condemn you to and stop following his will so that sin does not weigh on your soul. God has told me to warn you that if you do not take this message seriously, it could be too late. Someone could depart, and you will not forgive yourself for not having acted. Do not go through that bitter suffering. God is here to solve one of the biggest problems of your life. But for that to happen, you need to commit to listening to and following this message to the end. This way, He will be able to create a plan that helps you rise from all your falls and become a successful person. It is only a matter of time before you see all your dreams realized. Leave a like if you believe in this message.
Amen. You may wonder why you are going through these challenges and difficulties. I want you to know that every obstacle in your life has a purpose. They are there to strengthen you, to teach you to trust in me and seek my presence. In the darkest moments, I am closest to you, guiding your every step. Remember that you are never alone. My angels are around you, protecting and guiding you, even when the path seems impossible. Keep your faith and know that I am working for your good. I know the desires of your heart and am preparing something wonderful for you, something that goes beyond your wildest dreams. Comment 7070 to receive the angels of God. But for this to become a reality, it is crucial that you trust in me and follow my teachings. Stay away from sin and bad influences. Surround yourself with people who elevate and inspire you to be better. Dedicate time to prayer and reflection, allowing the Holy Spirit to speak to your heart. You have a mission in this world, and it is important that you fulfill it with courage and determination. Every act of kindness and every word of comfort you offer is part of the bigger plan I have for you. Never underestimate the power of your actions and the influence you have on others. I want to remind you that I am always by your side, ready to listen to your concerns and ease your fears. Do not hesitate to seek my help. Open your heart to me, share your pains and joys, and together we can overcome anything. Today, I make a special call for you to renew your faith and commitment to me. I promise that if you follow my ways, you will see great miracles happen in your life. The doors that were closed will open, and new opportunities will arise where you least expect them. Comment I am with God to affirm your faith. My plans for you are of prosperity and hope, not suffering, but I need you to do your part. Be faithful, be strong, and trust that everything is under my control. Heaven encourages you. Victory is assured for those who trust in me and walk in the light. If you are facing a specific challenge, give it to me now. Let me take care of your worries and show you the way. All I ask for is your trust and love. Together, nothing can stop us. You are loved, you are chosen, and you are destined for great things. Never forget this, and when the storms come, remember that I am here holding your hand and guiding you toward a bright and hopeful future. Jeremiah 29 verse 11 says, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for peace and not for evil, to give you a future and a hope. This verse reflects the message of hope and purpose that God has for each of our lives. In difficult times, we may feel lost and abandoned, but God assures us that His plans are always for our good. He promises us peace and a future full of hope, even when we face challenges. This passage reminds us to trust in God, Knowing that He is in control and that everything we face has a greater purpose, leading us to the realization of our dreams and the fulfillment of our destiny. We must trust in God and follow His teachings, staying away from sin and bad influences. God is preparing something wonderful for us, and we need to be attentive and open to receiving His blessings. The verse from Jeremiah reinforces this divine promise of care and hope, encouraging us to maintain faith and perseverance. Comment, I trust in God, to affirm your faith. 
My beloved child, listen carefully to this message because my angels are trying to help and protect you. You have been saved from someone who wanted to see you fall. Soon, you will discover that this person lied to hide the truth. It is difficult to face this, knowing that they never truly considered you, only wanting to know your feelings to later use you. But you will learn to break this bond. Satan is trying to discover your weaknesses and use them against you. He is studying your strongest traits and trying to bring you down. Therefore, you need to protect yourself and keep your faith strong. In this upcoming stage of progress, all evil will be limited against you because I, your God, will not allow you to shed many tears. Angels also warn you for the first and last time that a family member is in danger. If you want to bring liberation to your life and avoid this tragedy, share this message with everyone. This will show that you deserve to escape from this deep and bitter feeling that could ruin your life. I am very concerned because you are deceiving yourself. I want to take you out of this world of darkness and bring light to your life. I want to embrace you as my beloved child and fulfill my purpose in your life, as I did with your parents and your family. Nothing will reach you if you follow this path and escape all the evil of this cruel world. The enemy is trying to unleash something terrible in your life, wanting to bring back a great nightmare from the past. To protect you from this uncertainty, confirm today that the Holy Spirit can touch your heart, revitalize your energies, and bring new fruits to your life. The enemy is trying to destabilize your life, preparing great financial crises to make you unhappy. His plan is cunning and will only be satisfied when he destroys your life. The path of knowledge is a sacred preparation to face the storms of life with courage and an enlightened perspective. Comment 10 to affirm your faith and follow my commandments with devotion. Keep shining brightly, for great things are to come. Know that I am always by your side, guiding and protecting you every step of the way. You are precious to me, and each challenge you face is an opportunity to grow and strengthen your faith. Even in the most difficult moments, remember that I am with you, ready to offer you comfort and guidance. Sometimes the journey of life may seem long and arduous, but every step you take brings you closer to me. Even when things seem difficult, trust in me and keep moving forward. I have carefully planned every detail for you, and the moment I have chosen is perfect. Comment 8080 to reaffirm your trust in me and accept my guidance in your life. Together, we will overcome all obstacles and achieve great feats for my kingdom. Remember, my child, that you are not alone on this journey. I have sent angels to protect and guide you, and they are always around you, ready to intervene on your behalf. Trust in them and know they are working for your greater good. Sometimes it may seem like you face insurmountable challenges, but remember that I never give you more than you can bear. Trust in me and my wisdom, and you will find the strength to overcome any adversity. Continue seeking truth and wisdom in your daily life. Keep your heart open to receive my blessings and be attentive to the opportunities one place in your path. Each challenge you face is an opportunity to learn and grow. So do not fear the difficulties you encounter. Comment 2020 
to affirm your willingness to accept my blessings and follow the path I have laid out for you. Together, we will achieve great things, and your life will transform in wonderful ways. We will spread my light throughout the world. Know that you are loved beyond words, no matter the challenge you face. I am always by your side, ready to offer my unconditional love and support. Trust in me and know that together we can overcome anything life presents us with. Comment 6565 to reaffirm your love for me and accept my love in your life. Together, we will build a future full of hope and joy. Keep believing in yourself and your potential to achieve great things. With faith and determination, there is no limit to what you can accomplish. Remember always that I am with you, guiding and protecting you every step of the way. Comment 9898 to affirm your confidence in yourself and your abilities. You are capable of achieving incredible things, and I am here to help you every step of the way. Continue trusting in me and following my guidance in your life. With faith and determination, you can overcome any obstacle and reach your highest goals. Remember always that I am by your side, encouraging you every step of the way. Comment 41 foot to reaffirm your determination to follow my path and accept my guidance in your life. Together, we will achieve great feats and spread my light throughout the world. O oh God, who is in the highest heavens, listen to our humble words and sincere supplications as we turn to you in prayer. In this moment of stillness and reflection, we thank you for your unwavering love and eternal goodness that accompany us every step of our journey through life. Amidst the joys and sorrows, in moments of triumph and challenge, in the light of day and the darkness of night, we are aware of your constant presence by our side, watching over our well-being and guiding our steps with divine wisdom. Trust in me, and you will not be defeated. I have a great purpose for your life, one that will be filled with peace and harmony. Keep fighting and never give up, no matter what happens. My angels warn you not to make mistakes that could have serious consequences. There are people around you trying to destroy you, but do not be saddened by it. I know what I am doing, and I will not allow these people to rob you of victory. You will have peace and progress. I tell you that you may face a great financial loss if you do not distance yourself from that person who only brings you problems and delays. Break away from them to prevent hatred and envy from hindering your happiness. Satan wants to take away something you love very much, causing great suffering. If this happens, you will be happy forever. Distance yourself from this problem and share this message to be saved. Jeremiah 29 verse 11, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for welfare and not for evil, to give you a future and a hope. This verse emphasizes that God has plans of peace and prosperity for you, not of evil. He wants to give you hope and a bright future despite the challenges and adversities you may face. Remember that God is in control, and His plans are for your good. This reinforces the need to trust in God and follow His ways, knowing that He is working for your benefit and preparing something wonderful for your life. My child, understand that each day is a new opportunity to strengthen your faith and draw closer to me. When difficulties arise, remember that you are never alone. 
I am by your side, ready to guide and protect you against any adversity. Allow my love and light to illuminate your path. Even in the darkest moments, you may be facing challenges that seem insurmountable, but trust that I have a greater plan for you. These challenges are only tests to strengthen your character and increase your faith. Each obstacle is an opportunity to show your trust in me and your determination to follow my teachings. I know it can be difficult to understand why certain things happen, but I want you to know that I am using every situation to prepare you for something greater. Your dreams and desires have not been forgotten, I know them, and I am working to fulfill them in a way you cannot yet see. Do not let doubt and fear dominate your heart. Remember that I am greater than any problem you may face. Keep your faith firm and continue seeking me in prayer and reading my word. Every moment spent with me is an opportunity to renew your strength and gain a new perspective on your challenges. Comment 5050 to receive the courage to face your problems. I am sending my angels to protect and guide you, they are around you, ready to intervene on your behalf. Trust in their presence and follow the signs they send you. Do not forget that you have a mission in this world. Every act of kindness and every word of encouragement you offer to others is part of that divine purpose. Be brave and do not give up, no matter how difficult things may seem. Your perseverance will be rewarded, and you will see my mighty hand working in your life. When difficult times pass, you will look back and see how every moment strengthened you and prepared you to receive the blessings I have reserved for you. Remember to share your love and faith with others. Many people around you are struggling with their own challenges and need the hope you can offer. Be a light in their lives, just as I am a light in yours. Together, we can transform the world and bring more love, peace, and hope to everyone. Now, open your heart and let me guide you toward a future full of promises and achievements. Keep trusting in me, and I promise you will not be disappointed. Great things are coming, and you are an essential part of my plan. Receive now my promises with an open heart. Isaiah 41 verse 10 says, Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you, I will help you, I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. This verse from Isaiah reinforces that God is always with you, offering strength and help in times of need. He promises to uphold you and prevent fear or anxiety from dominating your heart. God's constant presence is a reminder that no matter the challenges, you can trust in His strength and justice to guide and protect you. My dear child, in the coming days, a special blessing awaits you. A great blessing is on its way. Watch this video until the end if you believe that Jesus Christ sacrificed himself for your salvation. This week is just the beginning of something big that is coming in the next few months. The universe is aligning in your favor, preparing a remarkable transformation. You will find the love you long for, the financial abundance you seek, and the deep healing you have deserved for a long time. Do not believe these words resonate in your heart by chance. It is my voice whispering, assuring you that the path ahead is full of hope, meticulously traced with divine precision. You should rejoice because, at this moment, 
the vast cosmos is conspiring meticulously to fulfill your journey. The stars, the winds, and all the forces of the universe are aligning to guide you with love and care towards a brighter future where joy and fulfillment await you at every step. Believe, for I am with you, guiding you with my eternal wisdom, and the doors of abundance will open in all areas of your life. Comment, I believe, to reaffirm your faith in this promise. Listen to this promise I make with all my divine benevolence. Exciting times are about to unfold before you. The sweet sound of prosperity is on its way to flood you with riches beyond your imagination. The new house of your dreams is approaching as a gift of love prepared for you. It will be the refuge of your faith and will bring comfort and security to your life. Get ready because this journey will lead you to a life of financial freedom where you can follow your passion and do what you love without financial worries. This is my gift, the fulfillment of your desires, and my promise is unbreakable. Now, let's explore the words of Psalm 23 verse 1, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. In these verses, the psalmist David expresses his deep desire to be in my presence and asks for divine guidance in times of adversity. David calls out to the Lord, asking him to hear his voice, teaching us that prayer is the direct channel of communication with me. He acknowledges that even in difficult times, I am the only one who can answer his supplications. David expresses his commitment to seek my face, learning about the importance of seeking me with all his heart, obeying my will, and experiencing my intimacy. Comment, I trust in God's plans to affirm your faith. Beloved child, in verses 9 and 10 of Psalm 27, David calls out to me not to hide my face or reject him. He recognizes that I am his help and salvation. Even when you feel weak or abandoned, you can find refuge in my presence because I will never abandon you and I am always ready to help you in times of need. David makes a powerful declaration of trust in me, affirming that even when his father and mother abandon him, I will take him in. This teaches that when all other sources of support fail, I remain faithful. I am your Heavenly Father, and my love and care for you are incomparable. In verse 11, David asks me to teach and guide him in his path, recognizing the importance of being led by me, especially in the face of enemies and adversaries. Likewise, you must seek me in all areas of your life, trusting that my wisdom will lead you on the path of righteousness and truth. These words invite you to seek my face with faith and confidence through prayer, the commitment to seek me with all your heart, and the trust in my faithfulness. Remember always that I am your secure refuge, your heavenly Father who will never abandon you, and your wise guide in all moments. My dear children, in this solemn moment, I exhort you to receive with faith my promise. The doors of prosperity are about to open in all areas of your lives before the end of this year. May hope and determination fill your hearts, for the blessings I have reserved for you are innumerable. Financial abundance, spiritual growth, deep love, and complete health eagerly await your encounter. Believe in me, for my promise is firm. Remain faithful to my path, practicing righteousness, for these are the keys that will unlock the doors of prosperity that I offer you. Pray and persevere, for fulfillment is near. 
Receive with humility the blessings that await you, for they are the fruit of my love and divine grace. Comment, I receive, to affirm your faith. My beloved children, know that this is the moment of your great discovery, closer than you can imagine. The love that makes your heart sing is at the door, ready to touch your lives with the melody of joy. Do not doubt but receive with gratitude the incredible things that are directed toward you. The winds of my grace are blowing in your direction, and I am weaving a fabric of blessings and achievements that will fill your days with the light of my divine providence. Believe and keep your hearts open to receive what I have lovingly prepared for you. This is the moment when my love manifests grandly in your life. Embrace the wonders that are coming because you deserve all the happiness that awaits you. Comment I trust in you, Lord to demonstrate your commitment to my promise and receive the blessings that await you. Dear child, the right moment is approaching like a shining star, ready to guide you. Imagine that destiny is approaching, whispering that it is now your turn, revealing something wonderful that will leave you fascinated. I, the Eternal, am taking care of every detail of your life. This is the moment I have prepared with much love, a special gift waiting for you. Do not be afraid, for I am with you, guiding you towards something incredible. Receive this gift with joy because it will show you who you truly are and the special purpose I have for you. The show is about to begin, and everyone in heaven is excited to see you shine. Let your light shine, child, for this is your moment. Trust in me and move forward with faith, for I am always with you. Be strong and courageous. Do not fear or be discouraged, for the Lord your God is with you. He will not leave you nor forsake you. Deuteronomy 31 verse 6 reminds us that accepting Christ means beginning to live a new life where he lives in us. Comment I trust in you, Lord, to reaffirm your trust and receive the blessings that are coming. My beloved children, in these crucial moments, I, your God, call upon you to receive with faith my promise. The doors of prosperity are about to open in all areas of your lives before the end of this year. May hope and determination fill your hearts, for the blessings I have reserved for you are innumerable. Financial abundance, spiritual growth, deep love, and complete health eagerly await your encounter. Believe in me, for my promise is firm, and my will is for you to prosper. Remain faithful to my path, practicing righteousness, for these are the keys that will unlock the doors of prosperity that I offer you. Pray and persevere, for the journey toward success and fulfillment is near. Receive with humility the blessings that await you, for they are the fruit of my love and divine grace. Comment I believe, Lord to claim and receive wholeheartedly this beautiful gift I offer you today. I invite you to reflect on the meaning of this truth in your lives. Allow Christ to live in you letting his transformative presence guide your steps and illuminate your path. Comment I allow it, Lord, to accept this transformative presence in your life. Dear brothers and sisters in Christ, the message of Romans 8 verse 28 is profound and comforting. It reminds us that all things work together for good for those who love God and are called according to His purpose. As we contemplate this powerful verse, let us surrender our lives to Christ, 
allowing him to live in us and guide us with his love and grace at every moment. May we walk in faith, trusting in the one who loves us and has a purpose for each of us. Right, my life belongs to Jesus to reaffirm this commitment. Beloved God, Today our hearts overflow with gratitude and love toward you because you are the faithful Lord who never abandons us, regardless of the circumstances we face. In the midst of the storms of life, you are our secure anchor. We look back and see your unwavering faithfulness, remembering the moments when you sustained us, wiped our tears, and lifted us when we faltered. Your mercy is like an oasis in our desert of sin, and we recognize that we are not worthy of it. We contemplate your grace that envelopes us like a warm embrace, forgiving our mistakes and giving us opportunity after opportunity. Your love is the source of our strength, the reason for our hope, and the purpose of our existence. Today, we humbly ask you to continue guiding us with love and faithfulness. Help us recognize your constant presence in our lives and live according to your will. Grant us the grace to reflect your love, sharing it with the world around us. May we always be grateful for your faithfulness, mercy, and love. Bless us and fill our hearts with your peace, joy, and understanding. Continue protecting, guiding, and sustaining us because in you, we find our unshakable rock, our refuge, and our hope. Let us pray together Psalm 91, He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will abide in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say to the Lord, my refuge and my fortress, my God, in whom I trust. For he will deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence. He will cover you with his pinions, and under his wings, you will find refuge, his faithfulness is a shield and buckler. You will not fear the terror of the night, nor the arrow that flies by day, or the pestilence that stalks in darkness, nor the destruction that wastes at noonday. A thousand may fall at your side, ten thousand at your right hand, but it will not come near you. You will only look with your eyes and see the recompense of the wicked. Because you have made the Lord your dwelling place, the Most High, who is my refuge, no evil shall be allowed to befall you, no plague come near your tent. For he will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. On their hands, they will bear you up, lest you strike your foot against a stone. You will tread on the lion and the adder, the young lion and the serpent you will trample underfoot. Because he holds fast to me in love, I will deliver him, I will protect him because he knows my name. When he calls to me, I will answer him, I will be with him in trouble, I will rescue him and honor him. With long life, I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. Amen.